بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ٹوڈے وی ول بی کورنگ سیکنڈ پارٹ آف لیکچر نمبر ون ہاؤ ٹو تھنک لائک کوالٹی ان دس پارٹ وی ول آلسو بی کورنگ سم کوشچن ریلیٹڈ ٹو کوالٹی ایز یو نو وی آلریڈی کور فیو کوشچن ان فرسٹ پارٹ related to those will be continuing further topics and questions which you will be beneficial for you in your professional life being a quality engineer let's start what you will experience with this question we not only concern about the experience which we already have or which a quality engineer already have but we also very much concern about the experience which we should have after the completion of project as well as after completing each step what we experience in that step in terms of quality and also in terms of its professional work obviously you will think and experience the tougher side to go back and fix the problem whenever we have a problem we think negatively obviously we think that oh now we will be going back and after covering these steps again we will be over covering opening these steps and solving the problem so avoiding all this work or all this miss uh, misachievements we have to be concerned at each step identified at first level the bug which is identified at first level which goes under many other levels and finalized will also be solved after me- solving the complexities but if we solve that problem at same stage at initial level as soon it occur then it will be more beneficial for us or for our organization now keep in mind that you are not only a person just paid to identify the issues you are not here only to identify the bug or error in the project or on any step it's not just cost of material there are also other factors to be kept in mind such that human factor which involves all labors which included in your team members or those people working in the organization because the people around you are also responsible sometime to make quality or to avoid the quality in your project involving in it some step on by different individual which make it expensive means human factors labors involved in your project or involved in any sub steps or the person in the organization the different individual are also expensive for your project why those people are expensive because often on they are also responsible to make the quality of your project they can participate they can give suggestion also so do the paid work and that paid work will cause so many expenses to the project now wait and think again being a quality engineer as you think of many questions so let's think something else if you will not argue at first step to visit the place at right time by right person 
the issue will be easier to solve as single issue and nothing will be affected because that is your cause that you ignore that issue that bug at initial level when it is occur and you keep going and doing the working and com- increasing the complexity of the project by doing that you not only increase the complexity of that bug to solve but you also increase the cal- complexity of that project because you are not because you are not giving the level of procedures so solving all the bugs and issued at initial level are much beneficial than solving them at final stage in actual you would be able to save time and money obviously your time money efforts everything would be saved if timely bug or issues would be solved and moreover if you check your quality while doing while make uh, during the project you check all the criteria all the standards then it would not be occur the bug would not be occur at that stage if you issue if issue discover after every step has been completed there's not has been undone in order to solve that so to avoid that efforts make sure to check all the standards and quality level while during the project this philosophy holds true with the softwares and it's one that should be embraced formula the journal generally we have different formulas in different subjects but here we have created our own to understand the differences and the creation of bugs and its solution formula to find bugs and identify the error is given as bugs easily found and fix less costly to address as we discussed before that if you find bug at initial state you cannot uh, you can not use much efforts you you cannot undo many layers while solving that issue or that error you just have to do one step if you find that bug at initial stage and you try to solve at once it's better to think about quality throughout the process because then you would be able to deploy the right system at the right time here we have the right system at right time the most important thing that right time so being a quality testing engineer as you are concerning about different steps you are also more concerned about the time it's not that you are delaying or solving the process or calling out the single developer who might cause an issue but actually it is the more practice of operational efficiency that how you are solving the issues that how during the work you can solve the bug issue and at time at right time you solve the right work the fixing is not the way or implementing the features is not the way but we need to found on make king sure that they are implemented in a way to meet over all quality goals and fulfill the needs of users all along the way it's not just to fix the problem it's how you fix the problem how you solve the issues which has been given by the different users user satisfaction is more important our lecture is ended with this this part of a lecture is completed 
stay connected with this channel for more updated lectures and courses. Thank you.